My name's Cornmo, and I'm from Denton, Texas. At the end of my senior year in, in college, this lady found an accordion and she, uh, she found it at a homeless shelter and they were going to throw it out. So she pulled it out and gave it to me. And then I started doing music for a, a juggling troupe and, uh, and then I started doing my own songs. I work at, at this place called Alloy, and uh, um, I'm in office services, and uh, it's a cool place. I played the office Christmas party there a couple of times. The CEOs are real nice. Keep the copiers full of paper and, and uh, move desks around when people need to move. It's, you know, it's all right. It's a... Uh, it's one of those jobs I can leave when I go on tour and come back and I still have something there. But hey, 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 hey! Don't go away, I got a knock-knock joke for you. Knock-knock! Dishes! Dishes the greatest knockers ever! Thank you for coming to the show! I'd been into circus since I was uh, um, in high school. I, I liked going and uh, their musician was quitting and he said uh, you should do two things. You should take my place in the circus because it's a great opportunity for you and second of all you should get out of Dallas and move to New York City because Dallas is great but the people that come see you are your friends and the people in New York that come to see you are people that can do stuff for you. So I took his advice, and it was good advice. Very good advice. Somebody was looking for um, entertainers, comedians, whatever, to do uh, a show that he was producing. And um, I guess nobody else wanted to do it. So I said I'd do it, because I'd, you know, I'm not doing it. Never done anything like that. It was fun for me. It, I, I don't know if it's a great show or anything, but um, I, I, uh, I'm proud of it. I just want to inspire people to um, to do do what they want to do, and part of it's you know like when you go see a. I know when an alcoholic comes to your school to tell you about the dangers of alcohol, he's doing that because he's been there and he doesn't want you to end up going through the same shit he did. And the same thing, I worked a shitty job for a long time and I was miserable, terribly miserable, and playing my, sh my accordion and wanting to do more with it, but I couldn't because I was working this stupid job. And I worked it too long and it took me a long time to figure out just to quit what I hated and do what I loved and uh, it's a hard thing to do but once you do it um, once I did it things were falling into place and I became much happier. Yeah! 